everybody? I'm back with another doll review. I know it's been a minute, but I'm back. I'm going to be more consistent this year, I promise. So let's jump straight into it. We're going to be reviewing these three dolls, these three beautiful dolls. See? Okay. Let's jump into this one first. Take out the box. Right, this is the first one. Let's start with her shoes. She has these nice pink sneakers. I really like them. I like high top sneakers, so I'm always gonna, you know, be a fan of these type of sneakers. Nice hot pink. Then let's take a look at her outfit. She has a nice blue skirt with a rainbow streak on the side. And then her rainbow top. I like her bling. I like when they come with accessories like um, necklaces and bracelets and stuff. I love that. So, and let's get into her hair. Let me take this off. Yeah, she definitely got it on. She's the curvy girl. So she's a curvy girl. You know, so she got body, yaddy, yaddy. Yeah. And she has a gorgeous face. She has a gorgeous face. Let me see. You can see her face. She has pretty blue eyes. And I like her hair. She has saran hair. So, you know, I'm a big fan of that type of hair. I don't like the the cheap plasticky material. I like this more type of hair. So this is how long her hair goes. Of course, when I do her um, makeover, I'm gonna trim her ends, but this is her hair. So her hair is nice and soft and it's a nice color blue. It has shades of, uh, uh, do they really have shades of white? I guess it's different like shades of white and blue, light blue, but that's her hair. Let me comb it out. Trim her ends. Once again, in the comments, um, give me some names. Drop some names. Like, what does she look like? What is she giving? When you see her, like, what names pop in your head? Make sure you put some names in the comments. I'm definitely going to get her a made-to-move body. A complete made-to-move body. She looks like she's going to be one of my faves. So that's good. But I approve. Overall, I definitely approve. I think she's really pretty. I like her hair. I like her outfit. Like I said, she's a curvy girl. So I'm probably going to keep her curvy by getting her curvy made-to-move body instead of one of the slimmer ones. But she's really pretty. I definitely approve. I think she's so pretty. Okay. Okay, so let's get into the next girl. She's a very pretty girl as well. Definitely pretty in the face. This is um, Fashionista uh, 215. 215. So let's get into it. I don't like these packages that they come in, the new packages. I like the old packages that the ones with the zipper you could put them in. It's good for traveling and stuff. These new packages, it's a no for me. Alrighty. Okay, so once again, let's start off with the shoes. Um, they're the basic white heel. I use these for my sorority girls, so definitely could use extra. Don't mind that, but it's the basic white heel. So nothing too fancy. Let's get into her skirt. I like her skirt. I like when they do this little ruffle thing on the side. I think that's cute. You can't really see too much from um because of the light, but it's a like a purplish skirt. It has some colors in it, like some rainbow colors in it. So that's cute. I know you can't really tell because of the lighting. But when I pull her back, some you could see it. You can see some of the rainbow in it. This is 
how it looks from behind. That's how it looks from behind. She comes with um, a purple bracelet. Like I said, I love when they come with their little accessories. She has a nice purple bracelet. You can see. There's a cute top. The stars on it. Turn her head and do it ahead after. So that's a nice cute top. Definitely approve of the outfit. I think it's cute. And it goes good with the shoes, even though the shoes are basic. I don't think um, it needed, the shoes needed to do any anything crazy it's fine how it is it didn't need to be too crazy on the shoes it complements the outfit she has saran hair so my favorite type of hair it's nice and long from the box you couldn't tell that it was this long but I'm happy that it's longer than what I thought it was even though I'm gonna trim it and fix that up and comb it So sometimes when they're in the boxes for so long, it gets tangly. But I'm gonna fix that though. Just wanted to see. Has a lot, few shedding. Shedding a little bit. But yeah, so this is her hair length. A little bit past the buttocks area. But yeah, she's a pretty girl. She's probably gonna be one of my favorites as well. The fashionistas that they put out, I think this came out in 2003, if I'm not mistaken. I don't think it was 2000 and 2023, sorry. I don't think it was 2024 that they came out. I think it was 2023. But either way, um, they're getting better and better with the fashionistas. They, they look more um, polished, I would say. But yeah, this is her. I'm going to get her made to move body. I got to see which girl... Um, matches her complexion oh before i move on i just want to get into her makeup real quick you see her lips it has like a little glimmer to it i think that's really really pretty it, it looks like they have you can't really tell too much because of the light but she has a little glimmer to her lips so this is her face she's a pretty girl pretty girl i definitely approve I like her. I think she's gorgeous. But yeah. Okay. All right. So let's get into the last girl. Um, she's a fashionista. 216. If you're interested in her. She looks tall too. She looks very uh, tall. Model-esque. So let's get into her. Let's take her out. And see what's up. What's she giving? I'm already going to like her. I can tell already. I like the tall girls. Yeah. Take all this extra stuff off. We'll get into it. I already don't like the shoes. All right. Uh, so. The shoes is a dub for me. Definitely don't like the shoes. What I, I believe they call these kitten heels. Forgive me if I'm wrong. I don't really wear hair, so I don't know. But I'm, it's giving kitten heel. You know, so I'm not a fan of that. And it don't really match the outfit, so it's a no for me. Love her skin complexion. Love it, love it, love it. I think she's going to be one of my international girls. So she's giving me very much African in London. So giving me British African accent. So, you know, come up with names. Like I said in the comments, what is she giving? What name is she saying to y'all? Give me something exotic. You know, she's giving me exotic. So don't give me a basic name. Give me something, you know, something different. But she's giving me London African girl though. Um, so the outfit is definitely a dub. It's a no for me. Don't like it. Um, I don't like these little ruffles on the side. But I understand because the theme that they're going for is kind of like a back in the day theme. But meets modern day. I get that. But mm -mm. with the other girls, no. They look very much modern. This is not, it's not given. So I don't like the outfit. A little closer. I don't like that at all. This is how it looks in the back. 
yeah, they had the audacity to have the little cut off. <laughs> nice try. But no. Um, her earrings, I love the earrings. I love those. Those are so cute. It gives me very bamboo earrings back in the day. So that's cute. They really could have done her, her better with the outfit. But that's her earrings. Let's get into her hair. She has saran hair too, which I love. And it's long, nice and long. So it goes down. I'm gonna comb it out. Once I give them the makeover, the hair will fall much better. So that's how long her hair is. She has nice soft hair. Not that cheap plasticky hair. This is good. That's how low it goes. And then let's get into her face. Here we go. See? Put it in the light more. She also has like a glimmer to her lips. Um, yeah, she has glimmer to her lips. Little glimmer to her eyes. I forgot what they call that. Um, when it has these, this glimmer to it. But yeah, I think it's pretty. I know a lot of people in the doll community don't like that. But me, I do. Me personally, I do. It makes them look more glamorous. So yes, that's her face. Pretty, pretty girl. When her hair is pulled back, oh, she looks so pretty. You can see her face. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fix it up. Fix her up. Yeah, make her look really nice. But she's definitely going to be one of my favorites too. I'm going to give her a made-to-move um, tall body. I want to keep that length. I want to keep her height. If we get her made to move, she's going to be one of my uh, model dolls. So that's her hair, her outfit, her shoe. But yeah. So these are the girls. I definitely approve once again. Yeah, sure. So if you're thinking about getting um, a fashionista and you're thinking about getting this collection, the 2023 or 2024, I'm not sure what year it was. But if you're thinking about getting them, this is them. I definitely approve of all three. They're both, they're all three uh, beautiful girls. They have saran hair, like I said. If So if you're like me and you like um, that type of hair and not so much of the plastic hair, definitely approve. Because when I watch other reviews, I like look to see... Um, if they mention the type of hair, because I don't want to get it and then it's the, the cheap plastic material. So I'm letting y'all know they have saran hair, very flowy, smooth hair. That's them. But yeah, these are the girls. And then I'm gonna get the made to move bodies. I'm gonna definitely keep her curvy because she looks really good, like how she is. So yeah, she's definitely gonna be one of my favorites. So yes, this is them. Like I said, so come up and come up with some names in the comments. What are the girls giving you when you see them? What names pop out to you? And I'll definitely see you in the next one. All right.